Okay, so next up. Next up, we have a fake Peter Sagan Venge here, Venge Vias. It's amazing that this looks as good as it does. When you get close up to it, you'll see differences. Um, but this is a counterfeit. This is not real. Now, a lot of people are going to look at this, and they're going to say, oh, it's from the same factories, baloney. It actually measures out differently. If you hold this up to a real one, it would look really different through here, different shapes and such. It's amazing how close they got. But the thing about these that's deadly, and again, is awful, are the handlebars. Now, this thing, um, again, we're li we're, 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 we don't know what's going to happen here, but this feels like a noodle to me. So what I'd like you to do is I'd like you to take this and just try to break it. See what happens. And that wasn't, I, I wasn't using much pressure there. No. I, I wasn't reefing on it. No. Um, that, so, yeah. So as an objective journalist, well, how does this make you feel about the genericness they put around I mean, this, this is frightening. As I said, you know, this is, I could see myself using as much power in that if I was in a sprint and really pulling on it. I could use that much power. This wasn't something where I really had to reef on it. I was expecting I was going to have to push on it pretty hard. Yeah, and that's this is to me this is terrifying. And so when people out there say, "Oh, it's the same stuff as the real," so we put one of these in the specialized torture test, um, and we have a torture test that's far beyond the standard, uh, 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 the standard, the standards that are for carbon handlebars. And our real one, I think the torture test simulated like. Decades and decades of riding. Um, the real one lasted, I think it was like 35 hours, and the fake lasted 20 minutes. And you just broke that. And by the way, this was shipped a couple weeks ago by the bad guys. So 